All right, we know Henri has moved through. Now comes the cleanup from the flooded garages to flooded churches. Folks who live in Westchester County have been hard at work dealing with what the storm left behind. News for us, Mark Santiasm in Marinac. He was there as the storm was moving through. He's there today. What have you been seeing, Mark? Well, David, let me show you. You can see the Mamaroneck River has receded. You can see the walkways, the playscape, the basketball court. You could not see those things last night. Henri has left, but it's also left a mess behind. This is not the angelic sound anyone here at First Baptist Church in Mamaroneck is used to hearing. The water came in, and we've been trying to get it out ever since last night. We have, we have guys here working since last night, but the more we get out, the more comes in. Several inches of rain poured into the basement, waterlogging tables, chairs, and tiles. In the street, it was real bad. It was real, real bad. Here on Howard Avenue, the mayor says eight people had to be evacuated. Everyone was okay. When they say flash flood, they're not joking. And Dewan Basteo has proof beyond just the cleanup and soaked garage. The family surveillance camera captured these moments as the Mamaroneck River spilled over the banks, then quickly barged across the Basteo's neighborhood, the flooding all taking place in roughly an hour's time. We were very thankful, you know, because, you know, some places got it much worse. Back here at First Baptist Church, the basement flooded. Everything must be removed. But after 98 years, the Reverend says the church's foundation is as strong as ever. Keep the faith. No matter what goes on, no matter what happens, we can never lose our faith in God. David and Natalie, the neighbors who live on Howard, it's just on the other side of the river here, tell us the cleanup will probably last a few more days, but they're just so thankful everyone's okay. We're live in Mamaroneck. I'm Mark Santia, News 4 New York.